Um, let's talk about Big Break. Did you find that it was um, that stressful? Because it seems like contestants are under a lot of stress. They are. And the biggest thing is, well, the hardest thing is, first off, is when you're on the Big Break, you have one shot. If you hit one good shot, one bad shot, one mediocre shot, and it's not good enough, you're off the show. Yeah. It's not like you have 18 holes or nine holes out here after you make a double, hit a bad shot, make double. It's not like you have that many holes left to come back from. To it. redeem yourself, yeah. Right. So Absolutely. here, you just got one shot and one shot only. So you just, you gotta hope you don't hit a bad shot. And how about the talent on Big Break? It's, it's getting pretty good. There's a lot of players coming through now. I tell you, they, since I was on there the last time, the talent has gotten a lot better. Uh -huh. It's more, there's more really good players instead of just like two or three. I mean, it's like all of them that's on there, the whole cast, they could just go out and play professional golf. Was that the best career move that you ever made? It was a great career move, I've got to say. And I got to thank the Golf Channel for giving me a shot to get on the big break and the big break as well because it definitely helped me out. Yeah, well, you're welcome. Okay. We, we like you. Uh, you've, you've done well by us at Golf Channel for sure. Uh, the feeling is very mutual. Very first pro event, you only were able to enter because a friend helped you out. Right. How did he help you again? He, pay, he paid the entry fee? I was working six days a week at A.O. Smith and I'd known him for a long time and he said, well, there's this teardrop tour coming to Columbia. He said, they're playing at Wood Creek Farms. You know, I'll pay you entry fee once you, once you play in it. I said, oh, okay. So he paid 600, 650, and I paid the rest, which was 100, 150, so no big deal there. So I ended up winning the tournament, and I, and I told him, I said, listen, I'll get how much to, of this do you want? I said, I'll give it all to you because really you paid the entry fee. He said, no, he said, listen, he said, I paid, I paid this because I think you're special. I see something in you that, that's special. And for him to take a chance on me, albeit it wasn't but just a little bit of money, but winning 15000 and he didn't want anything in return, told me that he was trying to help me succeed. And that's something, you know, a lot of, a lot of friends just don't do. I mean, there's yeah. a lot of people, if they in my, was in my position then, they would want at least half of it, if not most of it, or all of it. Sure. And so basically he just said, you're special, man. I, I just want to help you out because I think you've got it. Wow. That's a confidence booster. And I used one of your tees here, and mm -hmm. um, you said it has a special meaning. Besides, besides South Carolina. Yeah, besides the Go Gamecocks on there. Um, cancer. Uh, you know, I've, I've been affected quite a bit with cancer. Um, my grandmother a long time ago, my uncle three years ago. Um, it's something that just, something's got to be done about it. And I know, I'm sure all the attention everybody gives it about trying to find a cure, but you know, it's affected me with my family. And if it hadn't affected anybody else out there, it will, just give it time. So you're spreading and awareness. Definitely. That's we great. Need, we need to spread the awareness and we need to find a cure for it.